Hi everyone, in this video today, I am going to try and explain to you how to work out the area of a triangle and a parallelogram in under three minutes. So, let's start the timer. Parallelograms first. So, to work out the parallelogram, we need to multiply the base by the height. It's really that simple. What does base mean though? The base is always the bottom line of the shape. So here's the base, here's the base of the parallelogram. So I can see the base is one, two, three, four, five, six. Now I need to find out the height. Well, the height is how tall something is. I can see that this parallelogram is one, two, three three centimeters high. So to work out the, air, uh, the area of this parallelogram, I would have to do the base, which is six, multiply the height, which is three, and that would be 18 centimeters squared. So the base of this one is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and the height is one, two, three. So I need to do seven multiplied by three, which is 21 centimeters squared. How easy was that? Okay, triangles. Now for triangles, the formula is very similar. It's base multiplied by height, but then we must divide that answer by two. So the base, as with Parallelograms is the bottom of the shape. So here it's one, two, three, four. So the base of this triangle is four. The height of this triangle, one, two, three, four, is also four. So to work out the area of this triangle, I need to do four, which is the base, multiplied by four, which is the height. That gives me an answer of 16. Then I need to divide it by two. So 16 divided by two equals eight centimeters squared. This triangle, the base, I can see is one, two, three, four, five. The height is one, two, three, four, five, six. So for this triangle, I would do five multiplied by 6, which is 30, and then 30 divided by 2, which is 15 centimeters squared. Now, a couple of people, a uh, couple of reasons why people do not work out the area of triangles correctly is because one, they may forget to divide by 2, or the second reason is they don't calculate the height of the triangle. They think that the longest side is the same as the height, but it is not. It is how tall the triangle goes. Now, you may say to me, why do we need to divide by two? But with a parallelogram, we don't divide by two. Well, the reason why we divide by two is because two triangles make a square or a rectangle. And I can prove this to you by showing you this. So there's my isosceles triangle. So watch, I'm gonna split it into two. So it's the same triangle and look what shape it makes. It makes a square shape, doesn't it? And this one, if I take the triangle away, you can clearly see that two of these triangles make a rectangle. And when we work out the area, we divide by two with triangles because two triangles makes a square or a rectangle.